Who are the top five sprinters for the 2024 Tour de France? Those riders known for their explosive kicks and thrilling finishes? Well, there are too many riders to name for the race that begins on June 29th but I whittled down a long list to give you these essential cyclists to keep an eye on. And number one on everyone's list is Belgian Jasper Philipsen. Multiple stage wins in the Tour de France. You'll remember him last year. He took home the green jersey after four stage wins, twice second in that edition. He's had victories in the past in the Skill de Prix one day race. And of course, a massive win this spring in Milano San Remo with the help of star rider Matthew Vanderpool. Such a strong start to the season that confirmed his sprinting prowess. He's expected to be one of the top, if not the top sprinter for the Tour de France, heading up Team Alpecin de Kunic. Number two on my list of five, the Dutch rider Dylan Groenewegen, Team Jaqua Lula. The team sent Caleb Ewan to the Giro d'Italia it earmarked Groenewegen for the Tour de France. Multiple stage wins for Groenewegen. Five times he's thrown his hands up in the air in the world's biggest bike race, though last year managed only second and third in the sprints. Victories in World Tour races like Perry Nice and Tour of Britain, and now for 2024, after several consistent top finishes and wins in smaller races, he's ready for the Tour de France. He'll have a strong team to support his lead outs with Jayco dedicated to him. As I mentioned, Ewan's already raced the Giro d'Italia and it's Groenewegen heading for the Tour de France with their focus on the GC with Yates, Simon Yates. He's a veteran sprinter who remains a major threat for the sprints. And our next guy, Arnold Delee, 22 years old in his first Grand Tour, making of course his Grand Tour debut in the Tour de France riding with Belgian team Lotto Destiny. And it's a big one for the Belgian team with the Belgian sprint star heading it up. He's had smaller wins and performances in 2023, strong finishes in major one day classics like 10th in Omloop Pet Newsblot earlier this spring. He's building momentum and confidence heading into the tour, racing the Tour de Suisse. He's a rising sprint star who will challenge the established sprinting community and if we're talking about established sprinting community, well, it's Mads Pedersen, the Danish gun at Team Lidl Trek, former world champion back from 2019. Past results include two wins in the Tour de France, two stage wins, three-time stage winner in the Vuelta España. He's known for his versatility and strength in tough conditions. Already in 2024, he's had an impressive season, winning Ghent Wevelgem and on a rage in the smaller stage races in France and then of course in the Criterium du Dauphiné. He's a versatile rider who can win in various conditions, not just the pure sprints, who will enable him to go ahead when the other riders, those pure sprinters like your Groenewegen, can't win the sprint. Look for Mads Pedersen. And at the other end of the sprinting spectrum from Arnold de Lee, 22 year old, well as Alexander Kristoff. He, the Norwegian, is heading up a Norwegian team back to the Tour de France and such a strong, consistent rider, I had to put him on my list of five. Now 38 years old, he can still pull off a mean kick. He's had four stage wins in the Tour de France in the past. He's also had huge victories in one day monuments, Milano San Remo, Tour Flanders. He's known for his power and endurance and resistance. And heck, at 38 years old, he's still going strong. He's had a steady start to the season with solid performances, wins in smaller races, and places in the bigger ones. The veteran sprinter can never be underestimated, especially in harder stages, and leading one of the most exciting new teams, his home team, Uno X. It's going to be a thrilling three weeks with predicted eight sprint stages on tap. Pedersen, Dili, Philipson, Gronewegen, Kristoff, who's your pick? one of these five or, or name another rider. It's gonna be a thrilling fight out there in the sprints and for the green jersey at the 2024 Tour de France.